Hey, what's up everybody? I'm Charlie and today I'm going to be showing you how to make my delicious homemade buttermilk pancakes with homemade syrup from scratch. This recipe calls for you to make five buttermilk pancakes and two-thirds cup of homemade syrup, enough to serve about two people. Now, this can be increased to ten pancakes and one and one-third cups of homemade syrup, enough to serve about five people okay not only are the pancakes fluffy moist buttery and full of flavor and that syrup is sweet buttery and full of flavor but it is absolutely delicious and it is the perfect breakfast item so without further ado let's get started shall we here is all what you will need to make your homemade buttermilk pancakes and homemade syrup. Let's get started with our ingredients. You will need some all-purpose flour, sugar, salt, baking powder, unsalted butter, one large egg at room temperature, whole milk at room temperature, buttermilk at room temperature, light corn syrup, molasses, vanilla extract, and butter extract and there we have it pre your fire to medium high heat let's get started with our homemade syrup in a small pot add one third cup of light corn syrup one third cup of water one fourth cup of sugar one fourth teaspoon of salt and one tablespoon of molasses stir all your ingredients together let this simmer for three minutes or until the mixture thickens slightly it's been about three minutes now and our mixture has thickened slightly turn your fire off Add one tablespoon of unsalted butter, one fourth teaspoon of vanilla extract, and one fourth teaspoon of butter extract. Give this a quick stir until that butter has melted. Let this cool completely before serving. The syrup will thicken as it cools. For best results, make this the day before you make your pancakes. And you can also take your syrup and add it into a squeeze bottle. Now let's get started with the pancake batter. In a medium sized bowl, add one cup of all-purpose flour, one tablespoon of baking powder, one fourth teaspoon of salt, and four tablespoons of sugar. Stir all your ingredients together In a separate medium sized bowl, add a half a cup of buttermilk at room temperature, a half a cup of whole milk at room temperature, one large egg at room temperature, three tablespoons of melted unsalted butter, two teaspoons of vanilla extract, and one teaspoon of butter extract. Using a whisk, stir all your ingredients together until well combined. Now you're going to take your wet ingredients and add them into your dry ingredients. Using a sturdy spoon, stir all your ingredients together until combined. Your batter will be slightly lumpy and thick. Don't worry, that is normal. Let the batter rest for 10 minutes and this will help with the rising of our pancakes. Preheat your fire to medium high heat. Here we have our cast iron skillet ready to go. Let this get hot for 3 minutes. After 3 minutes, turn your fire down from medium high to medium low heat. Add 1 teaspoon of unsalted butter. 
spread the butter along the bottom of your pan. Let the butter melt. Add a half a cup of your buttermilk pancake batter. Let this sear for one minute. It's been about one minute now and as you can see the bubbles are floating along the surface. That lets you know it's time to flip your pancake. And there you have it. Let this sear for one minute. It's been about one minute now and our pancake is done. It's nice golden brown on both sides. Turn your fire off. Now we're going to remove our pancakes and place them onto our serving dish. Once on our serving dish, top it with a teaspoon of salted butter and your homemade syrup. Here is the final presentation. And there you have it. Homemade buttermilk pancakes and homemade syrup. Made from scratch. If you like my channel, hit the subscribe button. Hit the bell button if you want to be notified of my videos. You can also check out this recipe along with all my other recipes at www.charliecookandrews.com. You can also find me on Facebook and on Instagram under the name Charlie the Cook Andrews. Stay tuned as Charlie's Taste Test is coming up next. Ah, now it's time to go ahead and take a bite. Look at this. Dip it in a little sip. That little boy up there. Mm-hmm. Oh my goodness. The pancakes are fluffy, moist, buttery. That butter flavor really stands out. Mm. Then you have the flavor of the syrup, which is also buttery and sweet. A little hint of salt brings out all those flavors. Very, very good. Mm. I'm telling y'all, try the recipe and you'll forget about the box pancake mix and the bottled syrup from the grocery store. I'm telling you. Anyways, I hope you all enjoyed the video. So until next time, take care and I hope you all have a blessed day. Peace.